And hello guys! Give these a fuck off signal and turn around and say you are corrupt bastards. This is your Department of Working Pensions Office. They do um, assessment, uh, PIP assessments, uh, ESA assessments in uh, here as well. It is a consultation centre. Um, it's a fucking joke shop. Yeah, as well. Um, these are the bastards that stop your money. And, may, and think that you're not disabled. These are the bastards that think they've got power over everybody but the human beings them fucking selves. Power hungry bastards. Power hungry bastards. This is uh, also a uh, security team for this is G4S as well. You can also think they're power hungry bastards. G4S are also the... Um, a security firm that do a lot of the prisons. I think they're the government one now. Yeah, no, that's no, Circle. Uh -uh. But they've also got G5 in with it as well. Yeah. These do a lot of your M employment services. Yeah. Prisons. I'm sure they've got a government contract. Yeah. But We're going in. We're going in. We're going to in. Said. Got this way. Department of Working Pensions. Oh, the crook bastard building. Who we'll think they are fucking gods when they are just human beings doing a job. So, I'm the, 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 from up the fucking asses and stop being big headed bastards. But we must follow what the government says. Fuck the government. This is where they all check in. All the corrupt gits that think they've got power over everybody. <laughs> I think we've been followed by security, but now. Nah. Tell them to go and play with yourselves. Not more away. <laughs> this is all the Department, of working, all this is the Department of working Pensions. Go play Lee Crocs. All this is Department of Working Pensions. Every bit of it. Said. This is what our tax pays money pays for guys. This fucking building. It's massive. Oh look, access centre, parking, wanking. This is a free port to West Reception. Like I said. Joke shop. Department of working pensions. Yeah, the joke shop. You can go to work even though you fucking know you can't. Even the staff can park here, but they've got to park with their own at their own risk. 
shows you how corrupt these bastards are. This is the actually assessment centre, guys. Where they all go into your assessment. But if you notice, this is what's really stupid. They put it on a on an obstacle. So people that are going and claiming pip and things like that have to get round this stupid obstacle or stairs. Look how narrow it actually is. Narrow door, stairs. You've got a fucking walk. Yep. Well, I don't think you use that car park. Nope. All this building. Have you any experience with these corrupt bastards? Let us know. Where the black sign is. So, have you noticed no one actually manning the desks in here? And what's really also, the computers are actually facing the windows, so it's a breach of data protection as well. Our personal information is all that's on them computers, but they're facing the window. Safe for disabled people. Look at this obstacle again, bends for wheelchair access. <laughs> so, if you've got a wheelchair and you're not a carer, enjoy push it. It's a fucking hell, big bloody hell. Look at this, how steep it is. You get the carriage there because fucking other side of the bastard building. Yeah. Shows you. They don't give a hoot about us. They just want to be corrupt. LRCC TV, I know you're watching me. Do I give a care? Woo! There's no CTVs on it. Yeah, but it's not on the road. As I say, if you've got to come here for an assessment and you've got a severe disability, you've seen the. Here you are. You've got that hill there, and then you've got to walk another around the corner, and then up that road as hell. But sure is though, you've got a disability. Yeah. Oh, you could go up that one, because you've got a disability. Yeah. Imagine they have a fucking veins. Yeah, come and says. Shut this down, come and says. Hi buddy, are you alright? Have you had any experiences with DWP? Have you had any experiences with DWP for tests or anything? What do you think about the walk for people that's got disabilities try, try have to walk all the way around or up a steep oh, hill? Oh, it's ridiculous, isn't it? Yeah, and you've also got this big main road. Ridiculous, isn't it? How many people are actually letting down? Nice talking to you anyway, mate. Thank you. Yeah. Hi buddy, have you got any experiences with DWP? Have you got any experiences with DWP? No. Department of Working Pensions, has your money been stopped or anything? But it's these guys that are stopping it. No, no, not particularly. Yeah, but yeah, I can't, can't pass, but this is the problem. 
Right, this is the detail of your previous department of working pensions. Right. You know when you're on job seekers or I'll claim in PIP or ESA or anything yeah. like that. These are the guys that stop it. Yeah. I'm just wondering if you've had any experiences and you're willing to tell your story if you've had any money stopped or yeah. tried to claim in money and they put it on hold for, for six months or anything. Because these are the people that are doing it. Have you seen the walkways that people have to go with disabilities to actually get round to the testament centre? It's ridiculous. Yeah. Yeah. Bye. Thank you, mate. Yeah. Yeah. And as I said, this is what we. This is why we're saying. Uh, you've seen with the assessment centre, but what if you've got bad legs, breathing problems? Yeah, this, what? And this is what we're saying to you guys. Yeah. Why did the point it easy for easier access? All right, lads. Have yeah. you any experiences with DWP, any of you? Well, no. Yeah, yeah. DWP in this building. These are the cunts that are stopping it off. If you're willing to tell us your story to camera, I'm, I'm happy to. If you don't, I'll point it to the building. You have to appreciate what you're given. Yeah. Social security. Yeah. Yes, it can be arseholes at times. You don't look at it from a from your perspective, looking from their lifestyle. But at the end of the day, yeah, appreciate what they do for you. They give us money for nothing. Yeah. Yeah. You can't argue with that. You can't call them cunts and this and other. Yeah, they can be arseholes, but a bit drastic, they're giving you money for free. Yeah? yeah. Appreciate that. Okay. Or you could look at it on the other side. And they're not giving you enough, they're not doing this. You're not taking drugs, you don't smoke, you don't drink, you ain't got gambling problems. The money that they give you, you can live a life of luxury. Okay. I know because I've been doing this all. Alright, thank you for talking to us mate.